Hi, I'm going to show you how to install the Virtual MVP on a Z77 chipset motherboard. I don't have a very good system, but here we go. First thing you want to do is go into your BIOS and go to chipset. The integrator, your CPU configurator. And you want to make sure your internal graphics are enabled. And then what you want to do is with the install CD that comes with the motherboard, go to the software, the little cogwheel. Down at the bottom, it should have the Lucid Logic Virtual MVP. You'll have to activate it online. I've already got it activated, so I don't need to install it. But I'll show you where it's at here in a second. Let me close all this out. Okay, and your programs. It's under the Virtue MVP tab. Virtue MVP, now what you want to do is drag and drop it. I'm trying to do this while I'm holding my phone at the same time. You want to drag and drop it onto your desktop. It makes it a lot easier to access it. Alright, let me try this again. Alright, here we go. It's on my desktop now. It's, it's just a lot easier to do it this way. And what it does, it'll I've got it set to automatically minimize the system tray. Okay, here it is, it's open. You got by default the virtual vsync is off. You want to go in there and in performance tab and turn it on, make sure it's on. And now I'll you've got to on mine I had to actually add a secondary path for World of Warcraft for the launcher because the one that comes with Lucid it didn't access the right uh, execute file so I'll, it's really easy to do you just click on add browse and you find the, the execute file you want for the, whichever game you want to use you just click on it click add and OK and then you'll you'll be able to see it. I've got I've actually got you can't see the first one but I've got two World of Warcraft launchers in here. Now this is the World of Warcraft launcher and the other one is just World of Warcraft. It doesn't access the right execute file. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the difference between having the MVP turned off in the frame rate using, uh, I've got fraps. I'll show you the frame rate with it off. Let me disable it here. See, my frame rate now is at 60 frames a second, and I don't have a very good processor or, or hard drive, so if I'm doing anything that, that takes a lot of work, uh, it'll actually drop down to 23 or 24 frames a second, like in 40-man Shaw of Anger or Fight or something like that, it'll drop down to 23 or 24 frames. Now, if I enable it... The uh, Virtue MVP, I've got the icon set up. It shows up in the right hand corner now. And you can tell my frame rate is substantially higher, three times what it was normally. Okay, well, thanks for watching, and I hope this helps somebody out.